it's important for me to, s to see this in relation to each other because the, the, the nature and atmosphere is a complicated system. It, it's not the best way of studying it, decoupling the various topics because, and particularly climate change, influence more or less, I mean, everything. So uh, this is important. Uh, the temperature linked to the ozone is a very complicated topic. Uh, firstly, uh, ozone is destroyed on polar stratospheric clouds and they are formed at very low temperatures. So you would need to have very low temperatures to have chemical ozone reduction. Uh, what we see is that the temperature in the stratosphere has been going down the last uh, 10 years or 20 years. So this might be a linkage to, to temperature change. Uh, but furthermore, the temperature also um, is important for the dynamics. So it's, and also the temperature is important for the catalytical cycles forming ozone. So this is a very complicated topic and it's not easy to say uh, the influence of the temperature change on the ozone layer. The influence on the ozone layer is not so, uh, so easy to say. And this is still under investigation and still a lot of issues that need to be solved before we can mm -hmm. uh, conclude about the, the influence of this. Because the temperature profile in the stratosphere is, is, is important. In which height do you have the highest temperature reduction? Um, is it the same height that we form the polar stratospheric clouds or is it in the same height that we have the maximum of the ozone layer? Because this is uh, also influencing the production of the ozone and increasing actually the production of ozone. So this is complicated and, and it's still unresolved issues. The temperature, uh, the temperature will influence the ozone layer and, the, and particularly in the Arctic. Uh, but how long this will last because it's also depending on the CFCs which is now going down uh, and within the mid of this century we will have at the, at the level below 1980s and this will of course uh, not lead to more ozone depletion uh, but um, so, so it's many factors varying.